cover story in the wake of those bombshell allegations against Harvey Weinstein. Focus is now turning to what some women face in the workplace. A staggering 60% say they have experienced sexual harassment on the job. And ABC's Rebecca Jarvis is here with more on this very important story. Jasmine? Were you crying? What's wrong? No, n nothing's wrong. Jasmine, your eyes are all red. Tell me what happened. Come on, sweetie, you know that you can talk to me. You know, Tony, that kid that moved in down the street. And what did he do? Dad, please. I stayed late to finish my assignment at school. I was in the lab and he came in behind me. He, st he started touching me. I was scared and I tried to get him to stop, but he was too strong and then, and then when he let go, he started laughing like it was a joke. Dad, please. What is- Your little prick of a son put his goddamn hands on my daughter. Where is he? Excuse me? Your fucking son has been harassing my daughter for a week now. You need to do something about it. Learn how to handle your kid and teach him some respect. Oh, that's rich coming from you. This is fucking funny to you? It's pretty funny. Your sicko son putting his hands on my daughter is funny to you. No, that's not funny at all. What's funny is you preaching about respect. What are you talking about? You don't know me, do you? Maybe you don't remember me because it was dark? Or because I meant nothing to you? But I'll never forget your face for as long as I live. It only matters when it happens to someone you care about, huh? You know, I admit that my son has some behavioral issues, but we're dealing with that and I'm gonna talk to him. Because God forbid he turns into a man that's anything like you. Good day. I, I'm sorry. Let go of my door. But what I did has nothing to do with my daughter. So if you could please, please ask your son to leave her alone. I will. Like father, like son, huh?